What's up, DM Ink babes? It's your girl, Diamond. Back with another video with Diamonds and Mink Ink. Hopefully you guys have been active. Hopefully you guys have rung that bell already. And hopefully you guys already know what to do. Subscribe, like, comment, and share before we even get into the video. Make sure that you guys are also ring that bell. Ring it like it's somebody you don't like. Hey, ring that bell. Hey, ring it like it's somebody you don't like. All right, y'all. So today we are trying on Miss Shinny Dior's Lovely Gems. LLC. These are some minks. This one is called Rags to Riches. Starting off the flip, I love the cover. The cover is glittery. If you know me, you know I love gold. Gold is my color. Like gold is cute on my skin tone. It makes my eyes pop. Like, <laughs> come on now, gold. Gold is gold is lit. But anyway, um, I like it. It's glittery. And then I like the way that she um, has the text on it. Y'all, I'm whew, not here. I like how she has the text on here. So, we're going to open these bad boys. Oh, these are cute. All right, y'all. So, these are what they look like on the inside. These are number 35. Now, I like wispy um, and thick band lashes for one my eyebrows are huge y'all like they're huge and then on top of that my hairs on my lash are very 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 thin so the glue that i use um helps them stay but thick band is always the best for me always i like the feathering of it i like the spacing in between because for me spacing on lashes helps me determine the amount that i'm going to cut off and the amount that i'm going to keep I always go to number eight. You probably see this right here. You can see the marks on here. I literally count to number eight and I cut that mug off. Little tip for you. Let's get these lashes on. Do a little soft look. It's getting hot. Give me that. Another thing before we start this bad boy. Michelle Dior is a KC bound lash business owner. I did meet up with her to receive my minks. She's so sweet and she was on time, y'all. On time handed me my mink set was preferably, I think, 10 bucks or 15. But because she met me, you know, I had to give her a little tip because, you know, you didn't have to meet me, girl. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to Shani. And she also can be found on Facebook at Shani Dior. That will also be in the description down below. And I'll also have a link for you that you can just click it. Step one, take the lashes off carefully with a tweezer. As you can see, these little suckers are kind of hard to get off. You want to bend your band so that it is shaped in the forming of your eyelid. Now I am going to count until mark number eight, as I told you guys earlier that I do, to help me determine how much to cut off and how much to keep. All right, now I'm gonna take that end of the tweezer, get some glue, and I'm going to apply that to the lash band. You wanna make sure that you have enough glue and you wanna make sure that you have it evenly applied as well. Any excess of the last strip that you don't want, you can cut that mug off too. Blow it, girl, blow it. Make sure it's dry, but not too dry. You wanna make sure it's sticky. Right now, I'm about to apply. And got the lash on. Got the lash on. Wanna 
press, 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 make sure it's on. Yeah, I don't know what, I think it was with a ring on it. Can't remember, but anyway, making sure that it's on there good. And me, I know my pressure points, and I know how much I am able to take on my lid, so I am able to squeeze pretty hard, as hard as I need to, to make sure that mug don't move. They're so pretty on me. Finally, don't look bow-headed on my eyelids, y'all. One on, one to go. All right, y'all, back to business, taking that band off. I should say that strip, I'm sorry, that last strip off. And I am going to do the same steps that I did before, which is cut to number eight off and cut any excess that I don't need off the lash. And I'm going to apply some glue. Yeah, I'm over there jamming. Got my Alexa in the background doing his thing. So as y'all can see, Mega the Stallion came on on that part that I, of course. <laughs> yeah, no, know that's my girl. So I last shot to play me the first time. And as you can see, I'm playing a little bit too much. I'm a savage. A classic, bougie, ratchet. A sassy, moody, nasty. What? Act it. What's happening? I, I was happening. I'm a savage. So as you can see, finally got the second lash on. Texas gang, 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 gang. <laughs> yeah, that Savage Remix is what's up. Anyways, I'm squeezing, 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 making sure that lash ain't going nowhere. Yeah, I'm sorry for doing so much dancing. Listen, the music is to me. Music is my first love. So I'm checking the lash, making sure the bad boy's applied good. Gotta get up close and personal, y'all. Uh-huh, how they look, uh, 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 blink on them guys. So now we about to get a little natural beat going using that Nike, that Nike, and of course I shop at Ultra. I cannot remember what, no I'm lying, <laughs> it's right in front of me y'all. This is Stay Naked, weightless liquid foundation, 24 hour wear, number NN61. Now this stick is called Honey. This that Honey Contour stick right there. Yeah, I like it. Can't remember what number it is, but yeah, like it a lot. So here I just decided to do a natural look. So I'm starting off with a tan using the Naked palette. Love natural colors, earth colors, browns, tans, olives, peaches, all the above. <laughs> Most likely listening to Dojo Cat. Say so. 